You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week. I'm gonna be playing another Capcom game, but not a fighting game. This is Dungeons and Dragons Shadow over Mistara. And uh, it's a beat em up with uh, very light RPG elements to it. And I remember seeing this on the arcades, I played it just a bit. It was a. Uh, I really loved the art style here. And this did not get released on the PlayStation 1. It got released on the Sega Saturn though. And it remained dormant for a while. We never heard anything from it and up until, I don't know, mid 2000s or late 2000s, I think. It was released on um, Xbox Live. And it included the first game as well. Uh, yeah, this is a sequel already. Tower of Doom, was it? The first one? And way to go to press the wrong button. Alright. I am having a hard time. Okay, finally. <laughs> I had to like check my button configuration there you're not getting away Sure, if I actually saved him, I guess I did. And yeah, my name is AAA, like everyone else on the arcades. And yes, it is indeed a mighty name. Man, I should have chosen another character. This guy just kind of attacks uh, quite a bit slow. Your typical magic user, I guess. Oh no, it's that's more typical for the brute guys. War Machine. No relation to the guy in the suit, though. Kind of weak damage there. And it suddenly flamed all around.
Okay, my chance to try another character. I will try the warrior of... no, no, the master swordsman. Not named He-Man though. Those things on the floor are really, uh, uh, you know, sometimes it doesn't help that y you're forced to pick them up while the enemies are attacking you. Alright. And I am also called AAA. You can call me Conan, He-Man. Who else has a sword? Black Star? <laughs> and as you saw there, there are actually multiple route routes when you progress through the game. So a little bit of replay value there. This is Sparta. So at least, yeah, the enemies are varied here, so it doesn't get tiring, like fighting, beating up the same goblins or orcs over and over. But I like how the enemy sprites are actually large. See, this guy just has a bow and arrow, none of the magic that the previous guy I used had. Dark warrior. So, so satisfying to juggle. We don't see that kind of juggling this often in um, beat em up games I should try to stay away when he does that the thing is you know you tend to not really care since you have Infinite credits. Ah. All right, let me just beat this guy using the Mistress of Magic. All right. All right. If you've been curious about this game, 
I guess this is a good way to play it on uh, PlayStation Classic. And that should be it for this video. You're watching 8 bit days a week. This is Dungeons and Dragons Shadow over Mistara. It's a Capcom game, beat em up. And, um, yeah, welcome. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.